Hidden deep in the dense jungles of Mundumalai, by the banks of the Moyar, are a host of animals, little known and less understood. Overshadowed and overlooked, it is only now that they are being studied and valued. Guardians of the river and keepers of its banks are the water dogs of Moyar, the elusive otters. Twisting, turning through the unforgiving terrain of Tamil Nadu, the Moyar gives birth to an ecosystem unparalleled in its beauty and diversity. An ecosystem where otters thrive. I'm studying about the otter occupancy. First of all, I'm generating information whether otter is there or not. Is if yes, where are they present? How the habitat requirements? How the food habits? How the threats? I'm doing entire river research. Key to helping Narsimha Rajan transform his study into an on-ground conservation project is the Conservation Leadership Program, also known as CLP. Conservation Leadership Program is my funding agency. So after I received uh, some training from Conservation Leadership Program, then I uh, realized that okay, how the conservation work is important, how water research is important. Now I'm running my own project, you know, independently. CLP has been wonderful in that way because of the funding that it gives. So no one would be willing to uh, fund on a such a small mammal or some projects like that. A vital part of any CLP project is interaction with local stakeholders, especially the forest department. நீர்நாயின்னுடைய <laughs> Knowing when and where to set up camera traps is vital. Placed outside an otter den, this trap could offer insights into their behavior without disturbing them. Monitoring the cameras and ensuring they aren't stolen is a responsibility the forest department takes on. Increased interest leads to more patrolling and ultimately better protection for a creature that's vital to its habitat. Otter is a top predator in you know, freshwater ecosystem. A tiger will come and drink, go away. Elephant will come and drink, go away. But who is regulating that entire ecosystem? So that, that is otter. They prey on your dead and unhealthy fishes and thereby keeping the gene pool of the fishes healthy. If otter perish from Mayar, the entire ecosystem will be collapsed. Words, but true. The Moyar is one of the few perennial rivers in water staff Tamil Nadu. Its 90 km stretch supports nearly 300,000 people and generates hydroelectricity for industrial towns throughout the region. And yet, we want more. More water, more land, more dams, like this one in Paikar. Bleeding the river, drowning the trees, dams destroy riparian forests, change the river's ecology, and threaten not just otters, but all who depend on the river. Creeping human settlements displace forests, and farms trickle a steady stream of pollution into the Moyar. It's an agriculture pesticide runoff mixing into the water. More than 60, 70 villages found along the river bank of the river Moya. So they use heavy pesticides and uh, fertilizers, all of them mixing into the water. So it will affect microorganisms consumed by fishes, fish consumed by otter. Dramatic population growth 
and increased demand for water for agriculture has drastically increased pollution. People use oil motor for pumping water. On the edge of the uh, you know, river bank, they place their oil motors. They list enormous amount of oil as well as diesel, everything. They, all of them are mixing the river only. If increased pollution leads to a decline in fish stocks, fishermen and otters could come into conflict. Local stock too of poachers coming in and dynamiting fish, carelessly slaughtering otters in the process. If the otter is to survive in Moyar, it's time to energize communities about conservation. And this is where CLP-sponsored outreach programs have been invaluable. You have to work with the people that are involved. You have to work with the community that involved. You have to have a holistic approach for the betterment of the species. People should realize if I force them, they won't change. The behavior change, attitude change is important. And the forcing conservation, it would work out. So I strongly believe you know, making people realize, okay, this is important. When they realize that, then they will do the needful things. Taking a break from their outreach program, the team, along with the forest department, heads out to retrieve the camera traps. As they review the footage, they realize they have found something extraordinary. A species of otter never spotted in the Moyar before. Uh, one of the best finding is that, that we have uh, recorded first time the small clawed otter from the small river. A discovery that's tribute to countless days spent studying the otters. Days like today, where the team watches, hearts in their mouth as a lost juvenile searches for its family. Distraught it calls, and desperately the team watches, until an answering call. The otters reunite, and the researchers breathe free, and study how best to give these creatures a new lease on life.